Well, you are quite an unusual character, I've been told. Uh, your music has been described as cosmic, intergalactic, and a host of other terms. How would you describe your music? Well, it's the music of infinity. That's a simple term about it. It uh, is creative, improvisational at times, and it's uh, not part of the future. It's part of the alternative future. Okay. Some people have called you the founder of black contemporary music that also draws upon traditional black uh, classical music. Would you consider that a correct description of your music? Well, I'd say a lot of people have been trying to imitate me because they thought it was my ego speaking of infinity, but I changed so fast on them, they're beginning to wake up and see they can't cop it. It's one of kind. It's indescribable. Yes, it's because it's about infinity and eternal things. And that's why a lot of people haven't caught up with that because they're dealing with uh, the past and the present. I'm not part of those things. I'm from another dimension, and I'm playing the things I feel. And I don't feel too much about this planet. I feel other things, and that's what I'm playing. And we're going to be uh, talking more about that concept later, that you've been called the jazz man from another planet. Um, you have uh, also been described as, uh, well, someone who combines a whole different style of music. What are you going to perform for us today? Well, I'm, I'm going to perform what I feel. I always do that. That means I don't know. You don't know. It's going to sort of flow out. It will, it will do that. I do like, you see birds up in the sky flying. You never really know where they're going. They just follow the leader. I'm following my feelings. Last quick question is, your name, Ra, means sun in Egyptian. And obviously, I can tell with all your garb that, that this is an influence, a great influence on you. How so? How did that come to be? Well, uh, actually, over half the black people in America are ancient Egyptians, although they don't know it. And so I'm doing really what comes natural for me and them.